Hey guys, this is Comic You Know, and today I'm doing a review for Wolf Blood, and we are getting closer and closer to that uh, season finale. So let's talk about this episode. Uh, this episode's a Mr. Jeffrey centric episode, which is awesome. I love that, and I'll explain why. Uh, but with this episode, we get to see that Mr. Jeffrey finds out about Wolf Bloods. Uh, it's the tension, if he will find out, and by the end of the episode, he does. And it's the question, will he keep the secret or won't he? And by the end, he says pretty much nothing. He pretends that he forgot about it, or he, he pretends that he doesn't know about it. Just giving them the clue of, hey, I won't tell anybody. Uh, but I don't really want to talk about it at the same time. So, I don't know if Mr. Jeffries will be part of the pack, but he is going to keep the secret, and I think this will be very helpful in school. Now, why I really enjoyed this episode so much is because Mr. Jeffries is a really cool character. And one thing I love about Wolf Blood is how they utilize their secondary characters, especially their adult characters. Uh, most shows like this would definitely ignore adult characters altogether. Um, or just not utilize them that much, that much especially a teacher. Uh, he would so be a background character that did not matter. But with Wolf Blood... They make every character truly matter. Uh, even the minor characters, like the K's, who are hilarious in this episode, as always. Uh, but all these, like Jimmy, um, Liam, all these characters that probably wouldn't mean anything in other shows actually have a part here. And it just adds to that tension of, will the world find out about wolf blood? And Mr. Jeffries knowing, and maybe Liam knowing by next episode, it seems like it's getting closer to that fact of, people knowing wolf bloods exist, which has never been a rule that it can't happen. So I'm excited to see if that does happen. But getting back to it, one thing I liked about this episode so much was that Mr. Jeffries is not pushed to his side, but actually has a centric episode himself and finds out about wolf bloods. And I think this could be a really fun thing for his character, because I don't think obviously he's going to be part of the pack, but this will be really useful for the wolf bloods in school and how they handle situations. And Ever since Maddie's parents left, of course we had uh, Ridian's mother, but we've been missing that parent slash adult character that we had with Maddie's parents. So I think Mr. Jeffries wouldn't be a parent, but he could be that adult figure that the Wolf Bloods need, and I I'm really excited to see where that goes. So honestly, I thought this was the best episode of the season so far. I really liked it progressed the story a lot, and I think this is a character I would never expect it to find out, and I really liked how they handled it. Handled it in the end, it wasn't predictable, say, oh, I'll keep your secret, let me be part of the pack. It was him kind of shoving it off for now, but saying, I'll keep your secret, but like, I don't want to talk about it. And I thought that was a very interesting reaction to this subject. So, uh, really enjoyed this episode a lot. Again, favorite episode of the season so far. And they're mentioning Maddie a little bit more here, so hopefully, let's cross our fingers, we will see Maddie by the end of the season, now that people are finding out about wolf bloods. Uh, We'll see. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Of course, I'll have a review for Wolf Blood tomorrow and uh, until the season ends. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, don't forget to follow me on Twitter for Comic Ano and their uh, random situations. Don't forget to like my Facebook page. Also, in the description below, there's links for my comic book, Like Father Like Daughter. Don't forget to like the Facebook page of Like Father Like Daughter. And don't forget to back up the Kickstarter for Like Father Like Daughter. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.